objectives tonight are to select an appropriate outline which allows listeners to easily follow and understand her speech, to make her message clear with supporting material directly contributing to that message, use appropriate transitions when moving from one idea to another, and create a strong opening and conclusion. The title of her speech is My First Speech. And I asked all of our speakers tonight a fun question. This question was, which part of the Super Bowl did you enjoy the most? The game, the commercial, Lady Gaga's halftime performance, or I didn't watch the game at all? So Monica said, I didn't watch it. I lost my voice over the weekend. I was in bed before the game even started. So hopefully she has her voice back tonight. So please welcome Monica. Thank you so much, Dale. I did get my voice back, and that's kind of percent yet, but he's back. So, um... To the average person, if you have to go to a funeral, you are better off in the casket than to do the eulogy. That's what was said by Jared Sainsbury. So I did a little research um, and I found that actually 50% of the population share the fear of public speaking, and I'm one of them. I came to Toastmasters, uh, maybe not um, necessary of improving my speaking, it was one of the reasons that I wanted to actually expand my um, circle of friends. And that's how it all started. Um, I um, had to, it was a time when I had to prepare myself for my first speech, and I was terrified. So I tried to make it a little bit um, easier on myself. I divided this preparation into um, into three stages. came to the room before my before my first speech I talked to Sharon a little bit and she gave me so much encouragement and um, so much support uh, that when I actually came into the speech I was terrified my heart was pounding and I did so much yoga before and I did a lot of breathing techniques just to be relaxed but I still when it came to actually come and stand up here I was terrified <coughs> And uh, I blacked out at some point. I started speaking, but my mind went blank. And I was looking at Sharon. I think that was the only person who I saw because she was sitting actually across of me <laughs> in my eyes. And all what was going through my head was just get me out of here. <laughs> Do I go back or do I stay here? But 
Germany Postmasters was the greatest thing that I, I ever did and actually overcoming this fear, coming up here, being so much more comfortable than I was um, for the first time. Sweaty mess, right? <laughs> it it's great, and I'm not perfect. I have to work so much more, but I am becoming a better speaker. And because of because of those people around here who provide so much support, I'm becoming a better speaker. I'm a becoming a better person, a better leader, and I'm becoming a so much better person. Thank you.